This has been spoke about a lot during the season. Um, I probably would go with them, yeah. Whether I'd have a good time or not would probably be a different story. Um, we didn't lose, we drew against them. And I'd just like to add that in the afternoon we played against Licky Law and Lee Martin and we actually beat them, so I don't think he wanted to add that bit into it anyway. I probably, I know it's not leaving the field, but I think probably leading the boys out the first game of the season when I was officially made captain was, was a proud moment for me. Yeah, they've been fantastic this year since I've been here. Um, I try not to block it, I try to you know, use it to give you as much encouragement as possible. I challenge him to a game, whether I'd win or not would be a different story, but I'm up for that. I'll be XA, he can be anyone. Yeah, I think you know, every, there's so much hype about that game, um, I'm really looking forward to it. Red. Yeah, Devon's definitely my home. I think I'm settled down here with my family and my, my daughter was bored down here, so um, we enjoy it very much. So yeah. So. Favourite place to visit? Um, we like going for a walk down the beach every now and again. Yeah. I'd give it a good go. Yeah. I seen this one yesterday. We, we used to stop at Gloucester a lot. We don't really stop. I think we stop at Hopwood quite a lot which is up in Birmingham where I think, so that's, that's an okay one, I guess. Could be Stacey, yeah, he's gone on to playing in the Premiership, yeah, maybe Jack Stacey. And I think when I was growing up, there was a group of five or six of them who had come through the academy and started playing. I think Gilfie Sigurdsson was, was definitely one that has gone on to really good things, so probably him, yeah. Probably Liam Serkin because I've seen he give me a bit of stick on Twitter, so I'd like to give him some back. Yeah, special to me. Um, obviously, my family's down here, um, and we thoroughly enjoy ourselves down here. So it's nice to be part of a family, a community, and it's um, it's definitely a good place to to bring up children and live. I think Barnet away a few years ago was a good one. How, how what was it like? It was a Sweens ran over it and then I think it was a half volley in the top corner. It was one of my better ones for sure. <laughs> Nothing with Pierce for sure. <laughs> I think I'd like to go into coaching, uh, something I've always you know, taken a bit of a, a liking to. Um, so you know, eventually I'll start getting my, my badges and look, look to doing that. Yeah. I wear Nike red ones, I'm not even sure what they are to be honest with you. Yeah, yeah there's um, obviously Jaden Stockley was here last year, got on very well with him. Um, Liam McAlinden, Troy Brown, um, yeah, so there's a few. Yeah, since I first came down, the club's completely changed. I think the facilities, um, you know, the amount of staff we've got, the um, you know, behind the scenes it's really changed and the club's a, a club going forward, so yeah. Yeah, he was massive for me. I think without him, you know, I probably wouldn't have come down here in the first place. Um, he really believed in me and, you know, I would do over him a lot, so yeah, he was a big part of my early football career. Very proud moment for me and my family. Yeah, it, was, it was a special moment, yeah. We normally have dominoes or I normally have sausage and chips on the bus, so one of those two. I think the Stano one's a good one, it always catches, um, you know, it sticks in your head for sure. Me and Pierre share a room. Oh, so happy. <laughs> there you go.